this month has been a whirlwind. <laughs> Guys, how you doing? So you might have noticed I haven't been doing words of the day. It's just been because it's been mad busy and I think what I'm gonna have to do is to shift from word of the day and shift to word of the week. And that gives me an opportunity to look at what all the words are from the week and to choose the best word that I think really uh, kind of encapsulates what's going on or a word that I think might be relevant. So today's word of the week is the word Foray. The word foray means an initial or tentative attempt at a new or different area of activity. So a really good example of the word foray has been me on YouTube. I initially started a YouTube channel at the start of the year just because I wanted to have a place where I could point people for when I do hosting and emceeing and speaking. So I could just say, go to youtube.com forward slash I am Mr. Umba. So I signed up for a channel at the start of the year and having signed up for the channel, I realized that they don't give you a channel that says, uh, a youtube.com forward slash I am Mr. Umba. What I've instead got is a channel that says youtube.com forward slash which I'm never going to remember and then people are never going to be able to go and sign up and see what it is. What I did is I looked at what the YouTube guidance is about how do you get like a custom URL but in order to do that you need to get a certain amount of subscribers to be able to do that. So I started to wrap my brains about what could I possibly do, what kind of content could I produce that's going to allow people to come to my channel, to subscribe, that's gonna make them watch the stuff, and then it's gonna get me the thing that I actually really want, which is the channel that says youtube.com forward slash I am Mr. Umbo. This month has been a whirlwind. So we had like word of the day, um, and then we had things like wise guy, and some reviews. I had a conversation with a former student, and it started making me think, actually, I would quite like to produce some material, some content that might help people to revise or be introduced to like new concepts because I remember being in school and remembering some of the information just be going over my head because it was just like really dense or really boring or not presented in the way that was engaging. I thought, wouldn't it be really cool to present some content from things that people might be studying, might be learning about, but do it in a way that is going to be interesting. <laughs> Sheila was rich, no one would deny this. Go touch in a clutch like Midas. Gerald Croft was hot, the finest. Sorry, Sheila is a character from uh, JB Priestley's in An Inspector Calls, and it gives her perspective on what happened, like kind of after the inspector called. And it got quite a good response, and so then I decided to do the other characters. So the next one was Gerald's story. When I asked you to marry me, you looked me in the eye and you asked me. I looked back at you and I said, yeah, and you told me. And then after that, it was Mr. Berlin's story. Local businessman Arthur Berlin has been recently implicated in the death of a young woman, Eva Smith. And on my Instagram page, people were voting on which character they wanted next, so they voted for Eric Berlin. And so I've just dropped the Eric Berlin video. What can I get for you? A new life, a new family. You look like a whiskey man. How uh, did you know that? Trick of the trade. Just working through the characters. And then I started thinking, oh, wouldn't it be really cool to do other things? So we've literally just dropped um, Macbeth. We did the act one, scene one. Did you know all that glitters ain't gold? What a love can make man even give up his soul? Something rings in. It's nice to get people giving feedback and when you get a feedback like this and like this it kind of made me a bit more excited that oh actually maybe I could keep doing this which is what I'm doing. My goal for January was to get 100 subscribers where well, I think we're sitting at about 81. This has been my foray into YouTube so that's your word of the week. If you like the video comment below that's really really helpful for me. Like the video, share the video but also what was that noise? But also, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. And for all of those people who have subscribed, 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 thank you, thank you, thank you. Take care. Peace.